And a lot of leaders, managers are going to disagree with this, but I'm going to call this corporate cult out, which is the insider secret that if you're put in a PEP, which is performance improvement plan, chances are 99% of the time that they're planning to fire you. I said what I said. I was a manager for more than a decade in the corporate world. And you know what? There's nobody who said it in the team saying that I would love to support them with the PIP. I love putting people in the PIP. You know what? I want to manage them out. That's exactly why I'm doing it. Because in the event that there's a lawsuit happening, they want to protect themselves and say, I've tried everything. I've even put them on a PIP for support. But PIP is being used as not the support. Sometimes PIP has been used to lay people off as well. So that way they can avoid the severance as well. So watch out. If you're getting pipped and if there's no discussions about you not, in, not meeting a target and there's no clear discussion about the KPIs, then it's your right to disagree. And then document it. Document starts from disagreeing to it, emailing the people who are involved, including the HR your managers, managers, so that way if you get fired, then you're wrongfully dismissed. And that's not fair to you. So let no pip scare you. You have your right, but self-reflect and see if it's a right job or if you're missing the target, then you got to work on yourself before you start disturbing to it. Often if you need the exit plan, work it out, go outside because once the perception is damaged, there's no going back and fixing it. I'm telling you from personal experience. All right, you got this.